Another glorious day as Spider-Man. Still not used to calling myself that. Huh. I know it's usually an exaggeration to say someone's life changed overnight, but with me, it's actually true. And it all started a few weeks ago, right down there. Oscorp Industries, the world's premier chemical research facility. See, my class was on a field trip. Name? Peter Parker. Uh, P is in phosphorus, E is an electron, T is Okay, in... okay, you're on the list. Just wear huh? this at all times. Wow. My own Oscorp identification badge. I'm like science agent double helix seven. You're also like freaking me out. Oh. That's Harry Osborne. He's my best friend. This is the first year we're not in the same school together because he recently got into a school for geniuses, Horizon High. But he's here today because, get this, his dad owns this place. Harry, how are you not bursting at the seams? You're a science geek. We're about to see some of the world's most advanced equipment. <laughs> it's my dad's company, Pete. It's like if we went on a field trip to visit your Aunt May at a knitting factory. Huh. I didn't do it! Remain calm. Remain calm. Containment breach. Is it a reactor meltdown? Gamma radiation? Asgardian interference? Some experimental spiders have escaped. You're in no danger. We're collecting them as we speak. Spiders? <laughs> and here I thought we had something to worry about. Parker! Huh? Can you please stay out of oh, trouble? Sorry, Mr. Smythe. Harry, I thought Midtown High was rid of you. But if you insist on chaperoning us, please pair up with my son, Alistair. Peter's field trip partner is Liz Allen. Liz, keep a leash on Parker, will you? Our tour is about to begin. Yes, sir. <sighs> Welcome, everyone, to Oscorp Industries, the world's premier chemical, chemical research, research facility and electronics, electronics manufacturer. manufacturer. Sorry. That's okay. I expect you're all as excited as this young man here to get to use such state-of-the-art technology. But don't let the fancy equipment fool you, because if you're a true scientist, you can solve any problem with this. Using the five steps of the scientific method. Which are, of course, observation, hypothesis... Prediction, experimentation, and conclusion. <sighs> Sorry. Mr. Parker, another outburst from you and I'll kick you to the moon! Well... Scientifically speaking, Mr. Smythe, that's not possible. <laughs> <laughs> that's enough, Mr. Osborne. I'd say the only thing that unsettles a scientist is something called chance, when a situation has no scientific rhyme or reason. So, who's going to be the first to examine our new robot? Perry, how about you and your partner? That's when a series of unique circumstances why don't you let Pete's group go first? He's really into this stuff. Awesome! Line up so perfectly that the outcome... Wait, I'm a lefty. Switch with me. ...is an event of unusual magnitude. Ow! I don't feel so good. You okay, Pete? I don't know. Where's the... Down the hall to the right. No, wait, I think that one's under construction. Huh? What in the world's happening to me? 